I think it needs to be the foundation, right? Just like you would do a risk score to figure out where a client's risk tolerance or ability to take risk, risk and willingness to take risk would lie. Um, we become way overly reliant on those type of things. We need to do the same thing on the behavioral side. And actually, I've worked with, uh, with Jay, the resilient advisor, quite a bit throughout my career. And one of the areas we've worked with, uh, worked with him on was really kind of customizing a practice management approach around the behavioral aspects. And it started off very simple. We just want the client, uh, our client, the advisor, to identify whether their client's more emotional about money or more logical and that might seem on a spectrum too simplistic, but I always try to keep it as simple as possible. And the reason why is because that gives you a lot of information. If they're more emotional about money, and those are the ones that tend to stick out a little more, uh, you're not going to educate them away from making bad decisions. You